I'm joined by the Victorian Minister for Integrity. Minister, thanks for coming on. A pleasure, Rukshan. Minister, the Operation Watch special report contains some damning revelations of corruption within the Victorian Labour Party. How does the party plan to respond? Well, firstly, Rukshan, let me assure you that the Victorian government does take these revelations very, very seriously, very seriously indeed, which is why we've actually launched a full internal investigation into these revelations so that we can get to the bottom of how it happened. How the corruption happened. How the revelations happened. There's been rumours and accusations of corruption for over a decade now. Why has it taken this long to be dealt with? Oh, all those accusations were dealt with, Rukshan. Dealt with how? Oh, the usual threats, intimidation, kicking them out of the party. The lucky ones, we give them a cushy job elsewhere just to shut them up. But all of them, I assure you, were dealt with. So why is it different this time? Well, this time the usual approach didn't work, Rukshan, and that's what we need to get to the bottom of so we can deal with it. Deal with the corruption? Deal with the revelations, Rukshan. Wouldn't it be better just to fix the corruption? <laughs> to what? To fix the corruption. Deal with the people who are corrupt. That's a terrible security risk, Rukshan. A security risk? Yeah. Yes. How is fixing corruption a national security risk? No one's talking about national security, Rukshan. It's a job security risk. Minister, that's all we have time for today. <sighs> a million takes. Take 455. <laughs> Minister, thanks for coming in. A pleasure, Rukshan. For coming on. And that's why we have to... <clears throat> is the camera still focused on you? Know?